in Buena Park for Nutsbury Farms Taste of Halloween. Tickets are 35 for adults and 20 for kids. Adults get five tastings and kids get three and trick or treating passes. Parking is free. Let's check it out. Getting tear tots. <laughs> mm -hmm. We got some pastrami tater tots. It has some, some like white cheese and some pastrami. And then I got the pickled, um, what's it called? Pickled onions on the side. And some boysenberry mustard on the side. Here's a reminder of Let's give it a try. Hello. Warm the moment. I've been so easy. Always listen to your mummy. It tastes really good. It kind of tastes like a pastrami sandwich. With I would recommend it. I give it about four out of five. Is it nice and warm? Yeah, it's warm. That's good about it. The cheese is nice and gooey. How are the tater tots? Crunchy or soggy? Crunchy. Not too soggy. The cheese it tastes good with the cheese and the pastrami. The pastrami is not too fatty or anything. What are we gonna get? We're gonna get the graveyard funnel cake and the pumpkin cinnamon icing with sprinkles. Chocolate is good. It kind of tastes like a chocolate mousse or something. It has chocolate drizzle. Oh, it has chocolate drizzle. Let's give the funnel cake a try. It's like a like a donut hole, but like a, a crunchy one. And then the it's warm, it's really hot, so like the ice cream is really good with that. Or compliments as well. So here we have a Polish pumpkin. It's a cinnamon bun with pumpkin icing and sprinkles. nice and warm so let's give this a try. I love the decoration. Very Halloween-ish. Yeah, the orange and black. Oh, when you cut it, it smells. You can smell the cinnamon when you cut it. Yeah. Look at that. It's a Disney. I know. That's really good. 
is more the synonym than the pumpkin. Mm, pumpkin. The synonym is really overpowering. Like it's like a. Mm, it's like I feel like a bunch of synonyms. Oh okay. Mm. I mean, it's really good though. It tastes really like homey. Like you mm -hmm. want to eat it at home? Yeah. Jalisco Michelada. Yeah, Frozen Bloody Lemon Slime Margarita. We got a ten dollar mystery bag from Tattoo Junior. Three and ten dollars. Let's see what we get. I think it's it. We get two prints or three prints. Yeah. Wow. <laughs> and it's the Post Malone one. <laughs> wow. Cool. Guess, guess what the other one is. What? What do you think? Pikachu. Is that what you think? Yeah. Oh my god! That is so cute. It would do it was meant for us. What a coincidence. <laughs> you just got a Pokemon tag. <laughs> oh, cool. Thor versus, what's his name? A Chapulín with Thor, no? Yeah. The tattoos. tattoos. Cool. Oh, look. Look, you can have this one since you love uh, Thanos. Thanos. And I love. Freddy. Cool. I got this sticker. Yep. And the mystery bag was ten dollars, and the sticker was how much? Three bucks. Three dollars. Thirteen dollars in total. Far and wide to glimpse my pantaloon. The can can I kicked, legs stretched high in the air. Many a drunk <laughs> gathered to see the lady fair. By day I spun and danced on top of the stage. By night I worked at Goldie's and made a pretty good wage. Showing off my petticoats always brought good tips, but dancing was my passion. But bad for the hips. How did I spend my way to the hereafter? The bar was busy that night, filled with laughter. On the stage the bartender spilled a rye gin, right where my foot planted a wicked spin. Head over heels, I toppled to the floor. Ten years of dance lessons out the front door. Broke my neck in two, or maybe three. Enough for the undertaker to take his fee. My head is all floppy, as straight as a rag doll. But as a ghost, I never worry that I might fall. Here at the trick-or-treat trail. Trick-or-treat bag. 
this meatball sandwich, a ton of Hawaiian bun with some marinara sauce and some parmesan cheese on top. Some sweet potato kushkas rice. Kind of tastes like um, meatloaf. You ever had meatloaf? Like it has, it's not ketchup but it's like marinara so it kind of reminds me of it. Mm -hmm. It's nice and sweet. It's not um, too dry. It's moist. We give it a 4.5 out of 5. What about the fries? I'm not a fan of sweet potatoes, so I give them a one. Just they're too sweet for me. I prefer a salty, saltier um, fry, I guess. Grim Reaper sandwich. It has prime rib, cheese, comes with horseradish sauce, but I got it on the side because I'm not a big fan of that. Let's give it a try. It's good. It's just, I can use a little bit more meat. I feel like I got mostly bread in my bite. But it's good. I give it a 3 out of 5. The prime is good, it's just a little dry. Other than that, I like it. Burnt ends, burnt and ribbons. Comes with garlic mashers, aka mashed potatoes. In case you guys don't know, let's give it a try. It feels warm, so let's give it a try. It tastes good, nice and tender. The barbecue is a little sweet, but I like it. I give it a four out of five. The mashed potatoes, a five. Nice and garlicky. with onion ring and a naughty sauce served with french fries. Come with your meat. 
your onion ring, and your sauce. It's like a little burger slider. It comes with one, and then you're fried. I did not expect it to be this good. It's good? The sauce is spicy though. Mm. The onion ring gives it a crunch. a crunch. And the burger has like a little bit of cheese. And then it, the sauce is like perfect. I love it. I'm gonna try your fries. And they're, the fries are really good. They're like regular fries. But this is good. And it's like warm. What do you rate it? I rate it a 5. I really like this. Yeah, this is a good one. What do you like more? That or the ribbons? Probably that one because it has mushroom potatoes. But this one has fries. So actually it's both like... I eat both. Both equal? Mm -hmm. So those are your top? Diablo fries. It comes with french fries topped with chili, shredded cheese, hot cheeto crumbles, and crispy jalapeno strips. It's good. It's right. spicy. It's really spicy. Mm. That's why it's called Diablo Fries, I think. If you like the spicy consistency and spicy food, this is the thing for you. The chili is nice and warm. It's not the fries aren't soggy. You can taste the crunch with the hot Cheetos because it's a top. Okay. And then um, the jalapeno crispy. This is all like really good. I got the cursed cannoli, cannoli with a pumpkin mascar mascarpone filling and crushed ginger snaps. But I don't see the crushed ginger snaps. Maybe it's inside? Maybe, but it comes with like powdered sugar. So the cannoli is a bit cold, but it's okay. The filling, with the first bite you can just taste the, the pumpkin filling. I like the pumpkin filling, it's actually really good. Yeah. It tastes like the like a, the filling for pumpkin cheesecake. Yeah, it tastes like that. Or like pumpkin pie. That's how it tastes like. Like just this whole thing. And then the cannoli is nice. And um, it gives it a good balance between like mushy and like it's like hard. And the powdered sugar is good. I like it. What do you rate it? Mm, for a dessert, I want to say 5 out of 5. 5 out of 5? Yeah, I like it. I wish it was warmer though, but that's fine. This is the adult tasting card you get on upon arrival. It has the list of all the foods you can get and all the different sections. You scan it right, not this side. You scan this QR code to get your tasting. And you scan this one to see the map, the park, so you can find your foods. A lot of cool attractions and decorations. I recommend it. It's fun. If they do an next year, I recommend you guys get tickets. Yeah. But you gotta get them early. You got them sold out. You got them a few weeks early. <laughs> okay, you guys, so it's 9 o'clock and it's the end of the taste of following. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. You guys saw the good food that they give. And hopefully, they keep this up. They did just announce the one for Christmas, so you can get tickets for that. I suggest you do so because it's really fun and safe for all the family. If you like the video, like and subscribe. Thank you. Bye. Happy holidays. You guys enjoy the taste of following, and I'll see y'all next time. All right, friends? Thank, Thank you. you. Toodaloo. Oh.